With many Office 365 subscriptions, each user gets five licenses of the latest version of Microsoft Office Professional Plus that they can install on up to five PCs or Macs. And that's five PCs or Macs per user. The benefit of this is that every user in an organization is able to have the latest version of Office on any computer that they use, whether it's their work computer, their work laptop, home computer, home laptop, whatever. You can install the latest version of Microsoft Office on any PC or Mac you're going to use. And it's not a watered down version of Microsoft Office. It's not Office Home and Student with Word, Excel, PowerPoint. It's Office Professional Plus, which includes Outlook, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote, Link, Publisher, Access, plus a bunch of business intelligence tools and benefits that you can't buy retail. They only come with Office 365. So let's look at how we can install the latest version of Microsoft Office through Office 365. First of all, we go to portal.microsoftonline.com. And this is going to bring up the logon screen for the Microsoft Online Services portal, where we can enter our Office 365 username and password. Now when we sign in, it's going to log us in and give us access to pretty much everything associated with our Office 365 account. So we can use this to check for our uh, our email, our contacts, our calendars, they're all in this section here. Um, this is the admin overview, so it's going to be slightly different than what you might see. But uh, at the top here on the top right, this is basically what we're interested in. This is the um, Office 365 settings cog. And so we can click on this cog here and click Office 365 settings. And then on the left hand side we've got software where we can install and manage our Office 365 software. So this brings up the Office 365 installations associated with your Office 365 account. And if I want to install Office on this current computer, I can just scroll down to the bottom and click install. And this is going to bring up what's called a click to run and it's going to download Office to my computer and let me use it from this computer. So that's basically it. That's how you install Office through Office 365. If you have any questions, you can leave a comment or make an inquiry on our website.